don't have any expectations. I've been telling my children, I've been telling my relatives, I've been telling my uh, all juniors, etc. You can set your goals. You say after five years, this is what I want to be. When I went to Delhi, I thought that in five years I should become a senior counsel. There were a number of friends and family who said, uh, what will you do if you are not able to succeed? Then I said, if push comes to throw, I will go back home. I will go and do something which my father has been doing. You take that as a challenge and then go there. You can have your goals, that's for the purpose of reaching the goalpost. But otherwise, don't have expectations. If I expect something from Dr. Mitra and if he is not reciprocating it, I feel disheartened. I know where I stand with him. I don't expect anything from him. If something comes from him, I will be very happy. So, you are getting disheartened because of thinking of getting a post, not getting a post, becoming a judge, not becoming a judge. This is going to be a major dissatisfaction for every person in life. And the third aspect which I keep telling people is this. There is something called a social conscience for every person. You are very fortunate. You have everything in life. Or whatever you have definitely is something more than what people do not have. Be of some help to the deprived. I was talking to Dr. Kotishwara for a long time about the trust. I'm very happy that he's announced about the trust today. I wanted to be a part of it. I don't see myself in this profession for more than five years. I give a word to Dr. Kotishwara that when I turn 60, I'm going to be here. And I want to do something for the society. I can't drag my feet to the court after 60 years. So if I'm, if I'm of some help to the society, if I'm of some help to people around me, then uh, I think I've achieved what I wanted.